Hey guys, RS Chaos Master Brian here. So, Funimation just announced the 30th anniversary edition of Dragon Ball Z on Blu-ray. But there's a catch. They have to have 2,500 people sign up for this and reserve this. Which shouldn't be a big deal. But I really have to critique Funimation a little bit on this announcement. Because there's a couple issues with this that's just kind of like... What are you doing? Which... We'll talk about those issues, but let me just quickly go over what this set, what they have revealed about this set so far, okay? First of all, Toei Animation must be partnering with Funimation, which is a very good sign. It's going to be Dragon Ball Z, only Dragon Ball Z on Blu-ray. It looks like it's going to be all in one set at this point. Um, I can't really confirm that, which is complex, you know, complexing. Why would they not say, hey, this is all in one set, or hey, this is a reservation for the series, and it's going to come in five sets, okay? So that's the first thing that I just got to question Funimation on, is why didn't you say this is all, this comes in all in one set, or or this is so many Blu-rays, or, or whatever. Um, let me pull up the actual uh, article so that uh, I can show you guys what information they have revealed, which honestly isn't a lot. Um, let me uh, make sure I get on the right thing here. So what they have shown... is full series on Blu-ray, North America's first full art book, an exclusive figure, and more announcements to come. So it's going to have a full art book, but is it going to be in a limited edition set like the Dragon Boxes? Is it going to just be an art book with regular Blu-ray cases, which I hope not, but who knows. Um, what else have they revealed about it? Um... They reveal that something legendary is coming. Okay. The complete Dragon Ball Z series on Blu-ray with new bonus content. Um, a full-sized hardback art book available only in the set. An exclusive collectible figure not available anywhere else. And there's so much more to come, but we can't do it without your help. So they need 2,500 uh, people to reserve this. Which is not... A big deal but where's the details on stuff like is it in four by three are we getting another widescreen set come on Funimation don't do that shit like honestly four by three have the grain have it a perfect Dragon Ball Z set for all fans have the Japanese audio if you can somehow put in the broadcast audio for Japan that would be even better. Don't take any shortcuts. Keep the episode previews. Um, next episode previews. Blow us away. Put in the Pioneer track. Put in the original Dragon Ball Z uh, dub track as options. Have this the most amazing Dragon Ball Z set ever. Like, blow us away. Please, Funimation, do that. Make this a set that no one wants to pass up on. Because this is going to be like the Dragon Boxes. This is not going to be, hey, I can go buy this in a retail store. This is going to be, hey guys, you either reserve it and you get it, or you don't and you're an idiot. Those are your two options. Now what is going to happen? We shall see. But I know one thing, I'm keeping an eye on this. And... As long as it's not, you know, a half-assed, oh, we're just going to take the widescreen Dragon Ball Z and throw it onto, into a set, I'm going to get it. If it has anything that shows that they're putting effort into this, I will own it. Because Dragon Ball Z is awesome. That's just how it goes. Um, I'm extremely excited about this. I think it's going to be awesome. 
I think they're going to do this justice. And the reason why I say that is Toei, Toei Animation is also making this announcement. And they did not have announcements for the Dragon Ball Z Blu-rays for the stupid uh, Orange Bricks. Those sets that were terrible, they wanted nothing to do with. Toei Animation is on board with this. So get ready, guys, because I think this is honestly going to be a legendary set. And I think this is going to be the definitive set. And what I'm hoping for is that enough people buy this that they go, oh my gosh, we can do Dragon Ball. We I, we need Dragon Ball like this. We need Dragon Ball Z movies like this. GT, who cares? Honestly, who cares? If they want to do something like Dragon Ball Super as well after that ends, I would be all for it. I would buy it again. That's that's me. Uh, Dragon Ball Z is is literally my number one entertainment property of all time. Dragon Ball. Well, I'll say Dragon Ball, which spans the whole entire, you know, continue continuation. So I am very, very excited and I hope that we get enough people and that this is an amazing set and that it does really, really well for Funimation. And, and let's talk about price point. Okay, guys, I honestly feel that realistically, if this is the entire Dragon Ball Z series on Blu-ray and it they don't take any shortcuts and it has all these extras, a price tag between $750 and $500 is what you're looking at. I don't see it being any cheaper than that. I really don't. So a lot of people, that's going to turn them off, but... If it's like the Dragon Boxes, it is going to be freaking amazing. So keep that in mind, guys. You know, we paid $80 a set for the Dragon Boxes when they first were announced. 80 times 7, that's $560. This is going to be on Blu-ray as opposed to DVD. This is going to have a full-size art book. This set could be the size of the Japanese Dragon Boxes. Who knows? Who knows what Funimation decides to do? Instead of doing a, you know, really small box set, it could be freaking huge. Um, I'm very, very excited. Very, very excited to see what is announced. And I can tell you right now, I'm getting it. Unless, unless they go, oh, well, we're just going to take the Dragon Ball Z widescreen Blu-rays, throw them into a box, and... Slap in an art book. If they do that, I'll I'll forget about it. But otherwise, this set is for me. And I think a lot of people are going to be very, very happy about what this contains. And I think I think Funimation is finally going to satisfy almost everyone. There's always people that you can't satisfy, but I think they're gonna satisfy everyone. And I'm I'm excited. I'm looking forward to it. And I can't say any more than that. Dragon Ball Z for the win. Let me know in the comments below, guys. What do you guys think? Do you think this is going to be a brand new set? 4x3 aspect ratio. Dragon Ball Z, the best it's ever looked. Possibly with multiple audio tracks, including the Pioneer dub. And possibly even the Dragon Ball Z original dub audio. With, you know, uh, Dale Kelly as opposed to the uh, other uh, um, Ginyu. I think the options for this are unlimited and I think it's going to be amazing. How much do you think it's going to cost? Do you think I'm right around price point, $750 to $500? Is that too much for you? Is that is that a deal breaker? If they say, hey, it's got, you know, the Pioneer dub audio track. It's got the original Dragon Ball Z audio track. It's got the Faulkner audio track. It's got the redubbed audio track. It's got the Japanese broadcast audio. It's got a full-size Dragon Book. It's the size of, of a cereal box. Um, and it has the full series all in one box set. Is that enough to sell you at 
or let's say even $500? Or is that just too much? Is that a deal breaker? I want to know. Comment below. Um, look forward to more information on this because this is news. This is worth talking about and we will be talking about it on this channel. Um, I try not to talk about a lot of news type stuff. You guys have been that have been following my channel have known I'm mostly a channel for unboxing figures and that kind of thing. But this is news. This is worth talking about. You guys can even suggest video ideas about this. This is so exciting. And I just want to see if I can get this. Yeah. Oh, so if you would click on Funimation's, uh, you know, link about this, this is what you guys will see. Something legendary is coming. It's been 30 years of Dragon Ball Z, and we want to celebrate in the most perfect way with you. With your help, we're going to make a collector's edition worthy of a series this big happen. Here's a look at what you can expect from this epic collection. The complete Dragon Ball Z series on Blu-ray with new bonus content. North America's first ever full-sized hardbook Hardback art book available only on the set, an exclusive collectible figure not available anywhere else, and there's so much more to come, but we can't do it without your help. Guys, if you're a Dragon Ball Z fan, please make this happen. 2500 Now, the nice thing is, is I suspect whenever they go and do the reservation, we'll know, is this a 4x3 set? Does this come with the Japanese broadcast audio? Does it have, you know, multiple uh, audio tracks for the dub? We're going to probably, we're, we will know all that. So at that point in time, I'll make another video pleading for everyone to buy this that is a Dragon Ball Z fan, if it has all that. If it doesn't, I'll make another video saying, hey guys, this just isn't isn't worth it, you know. Save up your money and get the dragon boxes. But we shall see. Other than that, we'll talk to you later, YouTube. Thanks. Bye.